Good afternoon and welcome to Kelly TV with me, John Barnes. And what is Derek McInnes' first home league match as the Kilmarnock manager in the Championship? The opposition is Inverness Caledonian Thistle, who sits second in the table. Three points behind the leaders are both and one point better off than Kelly with a game more played. As far as form goes going into this match, Kelly are four league games unbeaten and Derek McInnes has uh, made a couple of changes from the side that started against Dundee United last week. In come Lee Hodgson and Kyle Lafferty makes his first start uh, for in his second spell at the club. Uh, the players dropping out. Blair Alston, he's on the bench. He had a slight knock uh, during the week. And Chris Stokes, who was off injured last week, he misses out altogether. Movement from McKenzie. Can't control it properly though. Up towards Sutherland. Sutherland's not got back the way. Mackay can take it for a run down at that far corner. He's done well. Great ball in! Oh, what a goal that is for Kelly! Kyle Lafferty's back with a bang! Off the left foot. Mackay with a delivery. And Kilmarnock are 1 0 up inside nine minutes. And Kyle Lafferty, his first of his second spell here at the Rugby Park Club. It's now 14 goals and 15 appearances for Lafferty. What a ball, you've got to say, the delivery there from the white there. Honestly, that, that's a good drink for a striker. However, having said that, it bounces in front of Lafferty there. That's not an easy finish. And his left side is well, he's turned that away really well. Right, there's applause around the stadium for the young lad Warren Graham who uh, passed away earlier in the week. He was known as the Killy Piper. And there'll be a club tribute to him at half time. Okay. In good position, nice little pass. Chalmers, Sutherland, out towards Walsh, trying to step over, and he fires that one across the face of goal. Hemming may well have got a touch on it. And uh, it's gone out for a corner, I think. Didn't quite see the flight of the ball, but it was a corner. Yeah, I think it was a corner. It's Hemming knocks it through the middle. It's over the head of Lafferty. Mackay's on to it. Mackay gets a break of the ball. Still Mackay pulled down. Play on as the referee. And it's gone wide of the target, but he's pulling it back for the free kick, I think, is he? Or does he play the advantage? I think he's played advantage here. He was going to give it. He certainly was going to give the throw there, John. Oh, it certainly looked like a foul on Mackay. Just uh, maybe just outside the box. Lafferty's looking for a corner, has he? <laughs> has he? He's, uh, he's remonstrating for something. Yeah, I'm just watching. Yeah, it's definitely That's a foul. a foul. Fraser Murray swings it in. Ewan oh. Murray bounces <laughs> off him and into the net! And Kelly are 2 0 up. No, it's not. They come off his hand. It did, it did look that way, it looked interesting to see the replay, but that's certainly the ref raised his arm there as if, you know, it was a, it was a hand ball and ball the line there. That was an interesting one, it's one worth a, a watch again. Towards the substitute, loses his way, shot, look for Mackenzie, overlapping wide in the right is Burke, through the centre is Mackay, Burke touches it back, he has the chance for the second and it bounces back and they're not the wide! How did he miss? Holy Shaw! He had two chances at that, and he's knocked away to the target. I don't know if the first one's hit one of the Kamala players, because it was a perfect comeback there for Chris Barton. That's a dream to walk onto that. The penalty area, I don't see in a wee second of the replay. It's difficult to say, but he's not caught that at all, the second one. Kelly looking for a second, and we're nice trying to get back in level terms. It's a high ball forward, Shaw with a head flick on. Here's Mackay. Slips. Burke. Into Mackenzie, looking for the return. Rory Mackenzie on the left foot, curling it, and parried away by Rogers. It was a lovely little give and go there, wasn't it, for Rory Mackenzie there? He's done it, we spoke about it earlier. We give and go with Hudson. Great play. We've almost hit six minutes. The referee looks at his watch, it's knocked forward, it's full time at Rugby Park. And Kilmarnock claim a vital victory against Inverness. Kyle Lafferty with the only goal of the game. Scored after nine minutes. 
as the management teams shake hands on that far side. But Lafferty, the goal hero for Killy, his first and his second spell. It's his 14th goal all told for the club in 15 appearances and a vital one that gives Killy the victory as they leapfrog Inverness into second spot in the championship table with this victory. Derry McInnes goes off to a winning start in his first home league match in charge of Killy. That's now five league games unbeaten and Killy's first home league win since the 30th of October.